Hey guys, how's it going? Kapran here. So today I thought I'd let you guys know about the situation with Crips Dust. So if you guys have been watching the stream, if you guys have been keeping up with the YouTube videos, you guys know that I have a lot of dust set up in Hearthstone. And uh, the reason is, you know, I've said it before, I've said it even in the video, that I try to not click the disenchant button, I try to not disenchant any cards, because my goal is to get two of every golden card, and um, because I can't buy them, yet I can't disenchant all the cards that I have extra and you know uh, craft all of them that I have it's best to save them in case cards get nerfed such as right now gets an auctioneer and flare those were nerfed so those disenchant for full value which I believe is like eight times more and uh, yeah that's there is an advantage to not clicking the button and there is no advantage to clicking the button so I'm not clicking the button until uh, I have enough dust to craft every single card in the game, golden times two, and of course, legendaries times one. And uh, I keep this track with a spreadsheet, and I wanna show you guys how that's going today. So uh, I did uh, I did review all the stuff today on stream. It was pretty boring for those uh, who are watching, I suppose, but you guys get the cool results here. So what I do is I track how many, and they're full golden set, uh, how many golden commons I still need, how many golden rares I still need, how many golden epics, and how many golden legendaries. And that pretty much uh, comes up with the dust required. Then I have um, the craft value, which just goes into the formula. And then I have the discount. So the discount is when you click the button, it automatically disenchants any cards you have more than you can use in the deck. So if you have like three, uh, oh, I don't know, golden of one card, it'll disenchant one. If you have three, uh, I don't know, Leroy's non-golden, it'll disenchant two, it'll keep the one. But that one that's not golden, I don't really care about that because I only want the golden cards. So uh, the discount is basically disenchanting all the commons, all the rares, all the epics, all the legendaries that are non-golden because I wouldn't care about those when I would get to the golden card. So you have uh, the discount, subtract from the dust required, subtract for how much current dust I have, which is about 150,000 right now, and the dust needed is 233,000. So this value is, seems really, 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 really ridiculously high, but uh, it does go down pretty quickly because uh, as I play Arena, as I earn packs, you know, I am no longer spending money on packs in Hearthstone. I bought a total of 240 with the monies and uh, quite a few more with the gold that I have. But from now on, it's only gold, it's only through Arena, it's only the earned ones. Uh, and this is pretty much uh, the fun of the game for me. Um, the reason the amount of dust I need is, is it seems like a lot, but it kind of goes down a bit quicker now is because I still need a lot of the golden cards. Now, my strategy when Goblin vs. Gnomes came out, uh, came out was to um, craft one of an epic card golden if I, if I needed the epic card, or if I needed a legendary, I'd craft it golden instead of regular because it's very unlikely to actually get epics and uh, legendaries golden through packs. So you pretty much just craft them in the, in the end golden anyway, and I thought it'd be a pretty good thing. That's why my dust total went down to the meager 150,000 that it is because I used to have like 180,000 before GVG came out, but uh, now I have quite a lot of golden epics and golden legendaries, but still I'm missing many, 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 many more. And as a result, the dust needed should go down. Uh, in terms of buying GVG packs, um, yeah, it's fun. You want to, you I hope you guys are watching the video. I hope you guys want to play Hearthstone. I hope you guys want to experience what GVG has to offer. But you don't really need to buy that many packs. On my European account, which is basically a free-to-play account, the only thing I paid for in that account was uh, the Nax entry fee, which was like 20 bucks, something like that. I can make some pretty good GVG decks, and I didn't actually spend any money. I only bought like, I don't know, maybe 20 or so packs uh, with gold. And, well... Because those were the earned packs, maybe I did a little bit better than I should have, but uh, maybe not. So from here on out, Crips going legit. We're only spending the goldies for the packs, and uh, I'll keep you guys up to date with how it's going. And, I mean, by the looks of it, I'll probably have in my disenchant button one day, probably close to about 300,000 dust. And at that point is probably when the button will be clicked. In the meantime, I want to show you guys uh, some GVG pack opening strategy. Maybe maybe there's something to it. Maybe the earned packs are slightly better than the bought ones because, well, you earn them. Well, 8 wins is really good for that deck. Mm -mm -mm. What the fuck is that? I didn't get 8 wins for a non-foil Tarn Warrior. 
Oh, I, that's good. 60 gold. And we do get the new packs. Okay, that's, all right, that, that bounces out. It's good. Yeah, that was a really good run with that deck. Oh, legend! Not bad. Golden Dark Bomb. Ah, shit, Vulgin. That's sick, though. I got a Golden Dark Bomb and the shit. Oh, guys, hold on, hold on. There's one thing I wanted to do and haven't yet. I'm gonna log over to my EU account and uh, open my three packs, right? I still got those. All right, so I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna check out the status of the European account. I played when uh, you couldn't buy packs on uh, US, and I hadn't received my three free ones at that point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Packeronis, let's do this. Oh, I got a disenchant uh, Gadsden and shit. Oh, legendary! Oh, two legendaries! I hate you already. Dude, first free pack. That's what's up. God damn it. We got a faux reaper. And oh, Not another faux reaper. Now what do we got? Uh, that's a pretty shitty pack. And I got Epic here, that's good. Epic is strong. Oh, Recombobulator, that's sick. Okay. Well, I didn't expect to get a... Actually, I should buy some packs of gold. Hold on. Let's just do that. How many are we gonna get? Uh, I'm, I'm already like in progress on an arena. So I'll probably get a little bit of refund on that. So we can go like 19. This is my free account, guys, so. The only thing I paid for here is, uh, Siege Engine, not bad, is uh, Nax. I paid money for Nax. Okay. Grove Tender, that pack kind of sucks ass. Alright, alright. Golden Shredder. Oh man. Oh, wrong packs! Nope. Nope. It's the right packs. Target time is a really shitty rare. Ooh, really like Kazan Mystic. Uh, I might try Illuminator. I don't think it's top tier, but it's a cool card. And I'm not making like top tier decks on free count. So. Well, a second Recombobulator and a Blast Mage. Alright, looks like we're going to be playing Mage, guys. Another Blast Mage. Dude, I can make a pretty sick Mage deck right now. Okay, we got a mechanical yeti. Oh my, I got a golden summoning portal. We're gonna have to do it. Golden zapomatic doesn't look very golden. Free account but paid for next. Yeah, I paid, what was it, like $20 or something? I don't know, it's been a while. Oh, another legendary! Come on, good one. Fucking Hammett, dude. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. We got a Jeeves. We got too many Glavezookas to even bother playing. Matter Bomber. A 
another Jeeves. See, there's so few cards in the set, I actually have extras already. Isn't that insane? Another legendary. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Oh, come on! What the fuck is that? It's Hammond Nessingwary again, dude! <laughs> <laughs> this expansion dude, blows. Dude, they wrecked. Man. They must have some sort of like programmed RNG for that. It's probably like transmogrifying your fucking like t god tier legendaries into okay. hemming. All right. Well, that's still pretty good. Like that's a lot of dust. So, whatever. Good run.